Missions getting this far. Unit 6 review. Remember, everything in Unit 6, the nice thing is, you need this equation. Y equals MX plus B. Alright, so, uh, this is an X. This is a Y. Slope is an M. What don't we have? We don't have a B. So I plug in everything I know. So 5 equals negative 1 times X, which is negative 1, plus B, which I don't know. Now I'm solving for what I don't know. So 5 equals negative 1 times negative 1 is 1, plus B. Get my 1 to the other side, so my B is alone. So B equals 4. So now I plug in my slope, my intercept, and my equation is Y equals negative X plus 4. All right? That's the great thing about this chapter is basically all the same thing, just lots of different variations of it. But this is read f of x equals y. So x here would be 0, y would be 2. x here would be 2, uh, excuse me, 2, and then y would be 6. So now, we have two points. We need an m and a b. How do we find m? y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So y2 is 6 minus 2 divided by x2 is 2 minus 0, 6 minus 2 is 4, 2 minus 0 is 2, 4 divided by 2 is 2. Then I gotta plug it back in, y equals mx plus b, y equals mx plus b. Alright, we can use any of these we want, I'll use this one, x and y. So I got 6 equals, my m was 2, my x is 2, my b I don't know. 6 equals 2 times 2 is 4 plus b. Subtract 4, and b equals 2. So y equals 2x plus 2. Now, some of you out there, really smart kids, are saying, well, this is the y-intercept. That is our b, because whenever x is 0, that's our y-intercept. And you could have done that, too, totally. All right? Let's try the next one. All right, so we have an x. We have a y. Now, it says perpendicular to this line. So the slope of this line is negative 1 over 7. Remember, perpendicular means I am going to invert this, so I want the re negative reciprocal. So the reciprocal would be 7 over 1, which is just 7, and it was negative, so it's going to be positive. So now we know our slope. So negative 3 equals m times x plus b. Negative 3 equals negative 7 plus b. Add 7. 4 equals b. Alright, so y equals 7x plus 4. Alrighty, and let's try a word problem here. Alright, Mr. Kelly made some investments last year. After two months, uh, the investment was worth $100. After four months, it was $50. So, we need some points. Two months, $100. Four months, $50. All right. Write an equation that models how much Mr. Kelly had. So let's find our slope. Y2, 50, minus Y1, 100, over Y2, 4, over my, or, excuse me, X2, minus X1. So that's negative 50 over 2, which is negative 25. All right. Y equals MX plus B. My Y is 100. My M is negative 25. My X is 2. So I have 100 equals negative 50 plus B. Add 50. So he started with 150. So our equation is Y equals negative 25. Negative, he's losing money. Plus 150. All right. So that's our equation. That said, how much money did Mr. Kelly originally have? Well, originally that would be his starting value his y-intercept, which would be 150 bucks. All right, best of luck on that chapter six test. I'm sure you guys will do, uh, excuse me, chapter five test. I'm sure you guys will do just great. Because you're a chicken. You're a chicken. Cuckoo ka cha Cuckoo ka cha Yeah. yeah. What are you doing? My yeah. women. A cuckoo ka cha I was just telling you. I 
haven't found the right girl. When I do, I will ask her out. Has anyone in this family ever even seen a chicken? The Lincoln. Oh, come on! <laughs>